today Boxing Day is something that I normally do for the kids, but because their kids are locked in, because of COVID, I decided to turn it on the other side for those who are less fortunate. So the day I am out here with all the food that we all would eat for Christmas Day with persons who could not afford at this time as the COVID has stepped in. Not only are these homeless people here, they're help people from different homes. Hiya. Yes, um, the Kiwanis had joined me one year ago and this was very good at this occasion because they normally feed with me um, the last Sunday of the year. And I want to thank them for making this Sunday one of the Sundays that they have donated their service to me to help serve and to help feed those who are less fortunate among us. Yes, there has been an increase in everything. You know, we are seeing kids, they are seeing families, more and more ladies who are on the street. Some of them are pregnant and stuff like that. How are you managing this time around? How to get it around? Well, um, it's not a problem. I must say that Corbett Barbados and some great persons had continued to donate into Fishers of Men Charity. So with food stuff, there's no lack with food for me. How much people, how much, um, people you are expecting to feed today? Um, I'm expecting to feed close to 300 persons today. I am Michael Blackman, the distinguished president of the Kiwanis Club of Barbados Benevolence. Can you tell us about today's activity? Well, let me first tell you about the Kiwanis Club of Barbados Benevolence. We were formed in December of 2020 and we immediately got to doing some community work. We had the opportunity to form a relation with Sharon Bellamy and her group Fishers of Maine and actually on Boxing Day of last year we did our first project with them here in Jubilee Gardens feeding the less fortunate and I know that um, some of the persons we feed are persons who have suffered some fallout as a result of this COVID pan pandemic. We are really a group of friends and family that has come together. Uh, at this stage, our membership stand at 21 members. Um, I'm pleased to announce as well that at the ending of our first year in office, we were designated as the Rookie Club of the Year because of our our achievements.